Today, we will be talking about how you can watch Kathy On Demand on your TV using Google Chromecast. Chromecast runs for about $30 to $35 online or at any electronics store. First, we will unbox the Chromecast by taking off the box then opening the flap to reveal the Chromecast. Just take out the Chromecast and put it to the side for now. Underneath the Chromecast you will see a couple of wires and adapters. First, we will take out the USB power adapter which may be used to power your Chromecast through an outlet. Next, we will take out the HDMI extender. This extender may not be necessary for everyone. Then, we will take out the USB to micro USB power cable. This is what's going to power the Chromecast. Lastly, you will see the product information booklet. We are just going to put that back in the box because we don't need it right now. Now, we are just going to put the box aside because we have everything we need to set up the Chromecast. Let's grab the Chromecast, which is still in its plastic casing. To take out the Chromecast, we just need to pop it out using the small hole on the bottom of the casing. The Chromecast is wrapped in plastic. You will need to take this off before using it. As you can see, the Chromecast has a micro USB port. This receives the power for the Chromecast and a factory reset button. Now, to power the Chromecast, you must use the USB power cable. Check on the back of your TV for a USB port like this. Plug the USB cable directly into the USB port on your TV. Not all TVs have this port. Then simply plug in the larger side of the USB to micro USB cord into the USB port on the TV. If your TV doesn't have the USB port, then you are going to have to use the USB power adapter. Just plug in the USB adapter into a wall outlet. Then. Just plug in the larger side of the USB cable into the power adapter. Take the smaller end of the micro USB cable and plug it into the Chromecast. You will get power when the light on the Chromecast turns solid white after blinking red. Now, we will plug the Chromecast directly into the TV. Check on either the back or side of your TV for an HDMI port like this one. In our case, the HDMI port is on the side of the TV. Take your Chromecast and use the HDMI end to plug directly into the HDMI port found on your TV. If for some reason your HDMI port on your TV isn't too accessible or the Chromecast won't fit, then you just have to use the HDMI extender. Plug in the HDMI extender into your TV so that the female end of the HDMI extender is accessible. Then, plug the Chromecast into the end of the extender. Now that your Chromecast is plugged into your TV, it's time to set up the Chromecast. Turn your TV on. Using the input button on your remote, change it to the proper HDMI input. If you're unsure which HDMI input you plugged your Chromecast into, just check the labeled port on the TV. In our case, the Chromecast is plugged into HDMI 2. So we switch over to the HDMI 2 input on the TV. Once in the proper input, you will see a screen similar to this. At the top, it says Set Me Up, with installation instructions underneath. Then, at the bottom you will see the temporary name of your Chromecast, which is the word Chromecast, followed by four numbers. Next, we will set up your device to the Chromecast that you have just installed. The next step differ depending on which device you are planning to use to watch Kathy On Demand. For the next part of the setup, you can use either your Android device, iPhone or iPad, or your computer. Please click on the device you plan on using to learn how to watch Kathy On Demand right on your TV.